we're back so i did not um finish i just put him down and went to doing my chores until i could come back in and and record with him but i wanted to show you guys because before when i was off camera before i put him up i was holding him a little bit and he just he cuddles in so nicely i love that see i'm such a cuddle bug um i don't know if i said this in, in part one before the camera was going dead um but he is really weighted to perfection and so oh well and so i really love that so i i definitely will not use his um tummy plate too often um except for photos because i love this this feel like i could just hold him like all day see i'm so sweet and he looks so real. That yeah, looks so real. I can't wait to paint um, this kit again. I um, I mentioned in my video before um, the Dwayne's and the Gabrielles were the two kits that I actually had the opportunity to do kit reviews when they first came out. And I've painted five of these of the Dwayne's. I think I added it up to be. Um, three awakes and two asleeps that I've painted before I did two giveaways of awakes no yeah yeah two giveaways with the awakes um I sold one awake and two asleep I think that's how it went um but I'm looking forward to painting them again and um but yeah so I really, really, I, I hadn't had much time, to be honest, to, to play with them and, you know, enjoy them and dress them. Oh my gosh, look at him. He looks so good. And he's actually very, very much close to my color, as you can see. It's, it's like, in their work in progress pictures, like you couldn't really see exactly where their end result was going to go. But I had liked them when she first painted, painted them, posted the picture. And I just, I guess someone, you know how people like stuff and it popped up and I was like, man, what happened to them? So I asked her and um, it went from there. Let me get him dressed. But, um, you know, I'm just one of those collectors that if something, you know, touches me and I always like this, the, the, the awake and then I kind of like the sleep but I like them both as boys originally um but my girl actually is now looking like a girl I don't know if it's the way that the hair is done or because you know I'm getting I getting to see her different you know paint it differently so I I like the girl as both boy and girl but the the awake I only like as um, a boy. That's just my opinion. But I've seen some people pull it off as a girl, but I just prefer the awake as a boy. Um, but anyway, I I just I'm one of those collectors that I like babies in my collection. That you know, as part especially my vinyl because vinyl come in such a huge number of kits. I really like my my um vinyl babies to be as limited as possible because you know it's it's kind of annoying and I, I don't i hate to say this like it's cool when you have your friends and we have the same babies and stuff like that but when you see like the same baby like a million times it kind of i don't know it get old i'll be honest i know it may sound petty but you you the rarity is what makes the collecting fun for me and the other thing i like about him too is that you can kind of change his expression when he puts on, when he gets on a pacifier he doesn't he looks more like focused and serious but he doesn't look as see i don't look as mean but i'm mean like my mommy you know <laughs> i'm not mean but sometimes people say that they think i might be mean but i'm not mean but um yeah, I just, oh my God, I love him in this, this shirt. Oh my God, this is Noah's. I love him. 
Oh my god. Yeah. I don't know. Give me a kissy wissy. I get a kissy kissy kissy. <laughs> I don't know. You done drop your passy. I don't know. I don't want to put him on his pants now. Oh my gosh. And this was the one thing that, you know, when they first came out, I said to, to people, I like them in the vinyl because the the legs wasn't as curved. And I know a lot of people love the, the, the ball up thing. I don't mind for like, you know, pictures and stuff like that. But I like to be able to relax my babies, you know. So that's, that's been my, you know, my thing about the vinyl. So I like it. I like the scope in the vinyl. I do. I do. I do. I I had grabbed these little joggers and I was like, I'm gonna put them on these little joggers. I'm gonna I'm gonna flip. I'm gonna flip this over his blanket over to the lighter side. Hang on. I know you're gonna drop this, so I'm just gonna pull it out anyway. He's like, really, mommy, really, really, really. Okay, so I'm gonna flip this. I'm just gonna make sure that I don't pull up my gown. <laughs> When I flip it over, flip, flip. So I'm gonna flip him over on the lighter side because otherwise he's blending into the blanket. <laughs> oh my goodness, he is so cute. But yeah, I, I don't know. Like I said, I really, I really like rare kits. And you, we're not, we don't have as many kits now that are just you know limited to a number. A set number anymore and um, so it's really nice to have like I haven't seen hardly any of these kits out um, I've seen a few and you know some kits aren't as popular as others but I don't know I think when they're painted when they're painted right they 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 are some really cute kits some really cute babies yes they are oh and then I seen um I guess Claire said, well, shoot. People are starting to ask for them. Because I seen one the other day, and that made me think about it too. Um, there's someone on Instagram that posts, posts one regularly. And it made me think about mine. Because my other one, it was a forever baby. And I said I was not going to ever sell it. But someone, um, you know, that have been following me for years you know said they really really wanted to buy and I thought I'll paint another one and I never got to it but so I'm, I'm really glad to have them back in my collection but yeah um Claire put them on sale the kits on sale so I don't know I I forgot what the the price was but I know that they're on they're on sale I don't know how long it's gonna last but it was like 30% off or something like that. So, say see. I'll, um, this is Hunter. I'll bring Holly on, his twin, um, soon. So, you guys will see her. I just got to find what outfit I want to put her on. But he'll be wearing this, and he'll probably wear it all the way through Thanksgiving. Um, when family come over, I wanted to get the babies, all my babies dressed and set up so that, they will um they will get to come tour the nursery because that's you know i'm sure they'll want to tour the nursery so yeah i just i really love him i, I do i i it was just something about the awake and it's just amazing to see claire's painting in vinyl um i see some of her same style um he's definitely you can tell like the way she does the feet, the way she does, it's just certain things and certain colors that she uses in her silicone babies. She's using the same in the vinyl. So it's really kind of cute. And, um, but I just love his face. I just think he looks super real. But I say him all oh boy. Yes, all oh boy boy. Yeah, I, 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 so now I'm going to go ahead and get him situated and I'm going to get his twin a little later. I'm going to go back and finish. I'm working on my closet. Oh my God, that's a monster. I'm trying to get my closet back organized. 
are cleaned out. So I'm working on that and I will come back and I will see you guys later. Hey, guys, if you have not checked out the first video where I started to change them, please go and check that video out. And also guys, please um, make a note that you should be a subscriber at this point. If you're not, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. And leave me a comment below as I read all my comments and I love to see the comments. Um, and what else was I gonna tell you guys? Yeah, oh, and again, once again, we will be going live tomorrow in the chatterbox. So if you're not a member yet, Go ahead and join. Um, we've got a quite a um, bit, a nice crowd in there. And um, I do live streams at least once a month. But I believe this will probably be my third one for this month already. So um, if you would. The first one was kind of like blah, I think. But the second one was pretty good. We did story time. I don't know exactly what we're gonna do for tomorrow, but if you wanna join, you have to click the link in the description bar. And um, I haven't been mentioning, um, I still have my merch going on, so you guys can definitely get your merch. I am going to try to work on designing a few more, something different um, for the, the merch um, line soon enough. But I had, like again, I said, um, just, becoming a, a more of a full-time artist has been um taking up a lot of my time so that's what i'm doing i'm not falling off from the hobby i'm not you know losing interest i am really dived more into it so that's i'm just i think i'm diving more into the painting side oh my goodness look at that oh boy oh my gosh That's one thing that you guys, you cannot take away. That's one thing you cannot take away from this 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 artist and sculptor, is that the realism in her her sculpts is phenomenal. Um. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at that! I just love that he they're they're my like my color like they. I don't know. I I love I love the skin tone. I don't. I, I'm looking at them and I kind of know how she got to that skin tone, but I wouldn't be able to duplicate it. Um, her technique is different, very different. Um, so I don't think I could do that, that skin tone, but I really like it. I know a lot of people um, like to use you know other artists work as a like a guide or inspiration I don't necessarily find myself doing that um I if I like the baby and I like the sculpt I'm inspired to want to paint the sculpt in my own um I want to see my version of it right so in order for me to do my version of it I have to paint it I paint it my way so I've I have a baby I just haven't got to that point yet but for now so far, I've just never looked at an artist's work and said, I want to paint my baby just like that baby. So, um, but it's just really fun to be able to collect other artists' work as well. And I think sometimes that makes it a little challenging for artists because a lot of artists be like really not wanting other artists to, to have their work. I don't know, like, I don't know. It's just one of those things that I, I realized you know, people, I guess they assume that you should paint your own babies. I don't know if that makes sense to some of you guys, but I like, I still like collecting other artists' work. I just hadn't had the funds to do it, and I just hadn't, you know, it's, um, it's a whole lot of, the, the market is saturated with reborns right now, but never mind. All right, guys, I'll talk to you guys later. We'll, maybe we'll continue this conversation in the chat box. And um, I'll see you guys later. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye. <laughs> He's not going to sleep no time soon. In fact, I think I'm going to take him downstairs when I go downstairs and put him in a swing so he could just look around. Yep. I think I am going to put a swing downstairs. 
So when guests come, Thanksgiving. No, no, no. Kids, kids will be here. Mm -mm. Never mind. Scratch that idea. Talk to you guys later.